Hello, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to show you how to use Figma to send your file to let your colleague or stakeholder to have a view So let's get started Alright, so today we have our app file here This design file is provided from the community which is a free design file so today I'm going to demonstrate how you can show your colleague or stakeholder even outsider to view your file. So this tutorial is mainly for people who are beginner or new leaf to Figma. So you have no idea how you can share your file. Uh, maybe you have a, you, uh, your question. Maybe your client have a question whether how they can get this design file or how they can build it or give you a feedback uh, maybe you are working in progress but they want to see the progress and in the traditionally you have to uh, save the file as a format like PDF and send it to your client which is very very hard to communicate because sometimes they don't have the app or they ha don't have the software like Photoshop like Adobe Illustrator your, your client didn't expect they have to have the app and then so right now Figma is, uh, is another way to help you solve this problem where you can share your link to your colleague, stakeholder, even a client uh, just a click so right here we have this design file alright though this file is under draft so the first method which is the share button the share button over here you have to be moving the file from draft into project so first of all we just choose move file and then we create a new team which is called team file or anything any name that you want to add all right so after you create a file you just have to click in and choose move so your file is right now moved into the team project okay so you share it and you will see this uh, little pop out screen right here so you have the link over here which is you can share anyone with the link to view or can edit but in this case we just want our client to view it uh, we don't want them to mess up our design right so we just have to copy the link and then you just paste to your uh, maybe a team chat box slack you can, you can do anything you just have to send the link by copy link okay so in the either way you can uh, send it by their email so I will send to my own email send invite so you have my our email right here so the app is going to let you to try it on the real life device to see whether the design file how to interact how to control it how, how the animation works and when you click this it will pop outward you click that it will be t uh, will be rich green so it's very convenient for a client to demonstrate to their maybe their colleague or even uh, even you can demonstrate in the meeting it's very easy and no, no hesitation hey guys I'm back so right now uh, I'm going to show you the second method which is you go to your browser and click Figma mirror so what is Figma mirror? So Figma mirror is basically uh, another web app to let you easily to show your prototype to your clients colleague or even the client so what is the time to let your client, colleague or your stakeholder to demonstrate your beautiful design file? So basically you will show your prototype file when you are almost done with your app and you want to get the real time device feedback. So basically your client, colleague or stakeholder holding the device, for example, for example they are phone, they, they can interact with it and see whether the app is uh, functional not but the functional means is when you swipe or when you click or when you touch your effect will come up or not or whether the screen is being linked correctly so it's very important to your engineer before uh, you have to try before you hand out to your engineer so they, so they don't mix up the screen alright so let us continue with Google okay this one I will skip it 
All right, now we are signing in. All right, so this is how Figma mirror looks like. All right, so right now it says select a frame or component that's directly on the canvas. Figma mirror is not restricted to local Wi-Fi network. If you're worried about your cellular data plan, make sure your device is connected to internet through Wi-Fi. All right, so in this case, we're going to use our iPad to device to show you how to use the Figma mirror. All right, so we are now in the page. Yep, Figma mirror. All right, let me try to log in. All right, so we have our Figma mirror right now. So I will show you my screen. Yeah, so we have the our Figma mirror here. So sorry, I'm using iPad, so it's not really accurate of the design file. But if you're using the same uh, device where you set in your frame size, it will going to be exactly same and it's very, uh, very accurate. All right. So wait a second. I'm losing the file. All right. So in this case, I'm going to click one of the frame right here, so it will immediately reflect in our device. Yeah, this is it. So, so this is how your client can see. Okay, so when I click, it will, it will have this like um, interaction. You can click here. It will show you uh, how to go back your profile like this back. Okay, your item, the ID address, and then. Click here, mm -hmm. and you can like, yeah, you can play with it with a device. Yeah, you can select the, yep. Not perfect in my de in my design, but mm, yep, it's going to be look like this. A little bit lag. I have to. Uh, I have to add mine because this is not really the size of uh, I'm designing for, so it's gonna be hard for me to uh, use it. Uh, yep. Yep. You have a lot of like pop up day, delayed. Yep. Alright, so that's it in my case. So in this method, you are going to show your client in Figma Mirror when you want to let them to experience the device uh, touch interactions uh, events. So uh, I recommend that if you are using the first method when you are doing your design and you want to show your progress to your colleague or friends or uh, stakeholder or anyone to get the feedback. And when you are slowly you are getting through all the design done, you already set all the prototype interactions and animation. You can show your client with the second method, which a little bit tricky because you have to show with your device, with your account. So in in this case, when you log into your account, you can pass your device to your colleague or stakeholder to uh, let them to try on your prototype in real device. So uh, yeah. Figma mirror is going to help you to basically to make sure that your interaction is working and yeah I see whether the real device how does it work or you even can pass to your colleague your engineer colleague to let them to try it out what if if I click this button it will go to where with screen so they can have an idea of okay in the first method I show you how you share your link to your colleague for your design file but what if your client and your colleague or your stakeholder want to see your prototype instead of the design file? It's pretty easy. You just click on your screen, your frame, click the display button over here. So now, now our screen is been loading. So so our screen is loading right now. So let keep a second. Wait a second. All right. So you can share prototype. So by clicking this. And then you copy the link, same like the metal one, you just copy the link or you can add their emails to this file, you send it right to them. And then voila, you can, your client can straight away see your prototype instead of the design file. So, in this trip method, uh, I will show you right now is uh, practically it's pretty easy, especially when it comes to 
uh, client that have no background of uh, software, non tech savvy, you just have to click the link. You just uh, you, you just have to copy the link. They just click the link and they will straight away see your design file or your prototype. They can comment to your design file or your prototype. Pretty easy, right? So yeah, hope you do your best, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.